Shalom. This is Bishop Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ. I want to start off by saying thank you to all of our Booster Club members for your many donations and much more your prayers. We visited faraway countries and strange lands. We've even spoken to dignitaries and were detained for spreading the glorious gospel in Cuba. The truth is that the descendants of the 12 tribes of Israel were scattered throughout the world. Help us on our journey as we continue to raise up the nation of Israel. 12 tribes worldwide. Join or donate today. Shalom. For the Lord has a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. Right, read that a little louder. Read that again. For the Lord has a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. Understand one thing. The Lord said he got a controversy with us. Bring it out. He got a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. What controversy does God have with us? Read. Because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of God in the land. See that God said there is no truth, no mercy, no knowledge of God within the land. You know what the problem is? White cops kill us, and we march, we protest all day long. When our oppressors shoot us down and kill us, we march all day long. But when a brother kill another brother, oh, it's just another day. N niggas get shot every day, bitch. We make jokes about it, we laugh about it. We say, oh, that, that was the, uh, uh, oh, that was this game, that was that game. We take things very lightly. Ain't no mercy between us. Ain't no truth among us, amongst us. Psalms 119, verse 142. Come on. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 119, and verse 142. Thy righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. God said God's righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. The wickedness, the sin that y'all are in, it's not going to last forever. The Lord going to kill a lot of y'all, I'm telling you straight. The Lord going to kill a lot of his people. A lot of y'all going to get caught up when America gets destroyed by the European Union in World War III. A lot of y'all going to get caught up in that. Why? Because a lot of y'all love the ways of America. A lot of y'all love white supremacy. You love Independence Day. You love the way your oppressor talks, the way your oppressor walks. You want to celebrate his holidays. You want to do what he want to do. So a lot of y'all going to get caught up what's going to happen to this place. Read. Thy righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. Those that keep God's righteousness, God said his righteousness is an everlasting righteousness. That's right. God's righteousness was in every kingdom that ruled on this earth. When the ancient Egyptians was ruling, God's righteousness was there. America wasn't there. When Greece, Rome, Persia, Assyria was ruling the earth, God's righteousness was there. Not amongst the government, but on the earth it was there at one point. But America and this wickedness ain't gonna be here forever. So y'all don't want to partake in this place, y'all gonna die with this place. Right. I'll tell you straight, I ain't gonna hide it from you. Read. And thy law is the truth. That's right. God's laws is the truth. Thou shalt not kill is the truth. Why every weekend it's 102 people shot? Bring it out. 67 shot this weekend, so-called 4th of July. We killing one another during a white supremacist holiday. Right. But then we want to march up and down the street talking about Black Lives Matter. Bring it out. And Black Lives Matter, why are we killing one another? Right. Why is we aborting our babies? Right. Why? Why not give the baby up to, for abortion to another black family? Why not, uh, uh, I'm sorry, adoption. Give the baby up for adoption to another black family. Why kill the baby? Why? Because we have a low self-esteem. Who taught us how to hate ourselves? Your oppressor taught you that. Bring it out. You understand that? And this ain't no hate speech. Y'all are people, man. We coming out here to build y'all up. You understand me? Y'all? We out here to teach y'all. Come on, read. The book of Hosea, chapter 4 and verse 1. Hear the word of the Lord, ye children of Israel. You ain't black, you ain't Hispanic, you ain't African American, you ain't Mexican, you ain't none of that. You're the children of Israel. That's God can't hear the word of the Lord. Read. For the Lord hath a controversy with the inhabitants of the land. God got a controversy with the inhabitants of his land. Of his land. With his people. Read. Because there is no truth, nor mercy, nor knowledge of God in the land. Ain't no truth among us, ain't no mercy among us, ain't no, or what? Or knowledge of God within the land among us. You understand that, brother? The knowledge of God is not found in the Christian church. You know why? Because Christian church was built on white supremacy. That's, that was a tool of white supremacy to keep us docile during the slave. A, uh, period. Right. During the Reconstruction period. During the Jim Crow period. During the Civil Rights era. 
Even right now in this modern era, Christianity is used as a tool to try to keep the black man docile so he don't rise up against his oppressors for what been done to him. Read on. By swearing, by swearing, we swear to the Lord, but we don't do nothing the Lord say. Read. And lying, and lying, we love to lie. We love to lie. Give me that in Isaiah chapter 30, verse 8. What do we lie against? Bring it out. We lie against our parents. It's talk, it's talking more than that. God said he got a controversy with you. This is more than just your day-to-day your -day life that we talk about. This is talk about a covenant between God and his chosen people, who you so happen to be. God judges his chosen people. That's why we went on the slave ship. And we still keep getting judged. Read. The book of Isaiah, chapter 30 and verse 9. Verse 8. Now go, write it before them in a table. That table today is known as the Holy Bible. Read. And note it in a book. That book today is Isaiah chapter 30. The book that it was written in was Peter, was Deuteronomy. It's called the Bible today. God told the prophets to note it and write it in the book. That what? That it may be for the time to come. Forever and ever. Forever and ever. God's righteousness ain't going nowhere. The scriptures ain't going nowhere. But America gonna be finished. And the wickedness that's here is gonna be finished. That's God right. said this place is prophesied to be destroyed by the European Union and Russia in right. World War III. They're going to rise up against the beast and burn her with fire. That's thus saith the Lord. That's right. Bring it Read. That this, Whether you believe it or not, that's what's going to happen. Read. That this is a rebellious people. God said, note it in the book that this is a rebellious people. Right. We're the most rebellious race that's on the face of the earth. All right. We're the most rebellious race that's on the face of the earth. Like, for example, the Chinese, they've been worshiping their God forever. The Japanese, they've been worshiping their God forever. The Indians, they've been worshiping Krishna. The Japanese, been worshiping Buddha. The Arabs, been worshiping Allah. But our people, we done lost our God. We done forgot. We done rebelled against our own God. So now we're worshiping the gods of white supremacy. Read that this is a rebellious people. So the 12 tribes of Israel, blacks and Hispanics, we are a rebellious people. Read. Lying children! And we are a lying children. We lie against the scriptures all day long. We say we love God, but we don't do nothing God say do. Right. We say we love God, but to love him means to keep his commandments. And we don't keep not one. Out of the Ten Commandments, we don't even keep not one. Come on. Children that will not hear the law of Go the ahead. Lord. Oh, Y'all good. Y'all can walk past. Yeah. God said we are children that don't want to hear the law of the Lord. We don't want to hear the law of the Lord. That's why when the, when the prophets come out and teach the laws, we don't want to hear it. We got something else to do. Come on with it. We say to the seers, see not. I say to the prophets, see not. Move around. Come on with it. And to the prophets, prophesy not unto us right things. They don't want to hear right things. They don't want to hear the commands. They don't want to hear thou shalt not kill. Thou shalt not steal. They don't want to hear the judgments for being a sodomite. They don't want to hear the judgments for doing evil. Bring it out. We don't want to hear that. We want to hear it feel good. We want to hear hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, I see Moses <laughs> walking down the river. <laughs> That's what we want to hear. Right. We want to hear game. Teach. We're not out here to run game on you. We out here to teach you right things. Right. That's right. Read. Speak unto us smooth things. I want us to speak, speak unto you smooth things. We can't do that. We got to tell you the truth. Time is short. Prophesy deceits. I want us to prophesy deceits. Like Christianity is a deceit. Right. Christianity went around the world. They killed the Native American Indians, right? Bring it out. And then they enslaved the southern kingdom of Israel, who you know today as the African Americans, the Haitians, and the Jamaicans, and the Caribbean slaves. Go ahead. They enslaved God's people. And then they want to build churches on that stolen land where the bones of the slaves and the bones of the Native American Indians is at. And they build a religion, and y'all go to their church right. and talk about you know God when you come to us. Right. Y'all love to see. Read. Get you out of the way. You tell us, get out the way. Read. Turn aside out of the path. Cause the Holy One of Israel to cease from before us. Wherefore, thus say the Holy One of Israel. God got something to say. We do all that talking. Oh, God knows my heart. God knows my heart. We love to talk, but God's got something to say out the book. Read. 
because he despised this word. Yeah, because we despise this word, that's why we getting gunned down in the street. Right. Because we despise the word of God, that's why 102 people are shot every weekend. 67 people are shot every weekend. Bring it out. 90 people are shot every weekend. Our own kids is getting shot and dying every week. Why? Because we despise the word of the Lord. A simple thing is thou shalt not kill. We despise that. No, I got to get revenge. I got to slide on it. That's why. So guess what? God going to have somebody slide on you and lay you down. God said, whosoever shed his man's blood, by man shall his blood be shed. Bring it out. Whosoever a man soweth, that shall he reap. However you live your life, that's how you're going to die. That's why it pays to be righteous. When you do dirt, dirt going to come back on you. Ask these old folks who done lived a little bit. They going to tell you that. They know that. Read. Because you young millennials, you young folks out here, 20, 30, 15 years old, y'all don't know nothing. Y'all don't know that when you do evil, evil come back on you. That's why when you get jammed up on 26 in California, you're trying to ask, why? Why? Because we don't want to keep the laws of God. That's why. Right. Read. Because you despise this word. Because you despise the word of God. Read. And trust in oppression. You trust in oppression. That's why a lot of y'all celebrated 4th of July. That's right. Talk about Black Lives Matter. Right. You want to scream about oppression, but you trust in 4th of July. We trust in oppression. A lot of y'all think that food stamps is good. Oh, I get food in my house. No, that's oppression. When we got food stamps and welfare in the 70s, the fathers had to leave the household. That's why it's a lot of fathers that's not in the house. Because when we was on Section 8, when we, we was on assistant living, our fathers could not be in the household. But you know what? Instead, uh, the black woman didn't say, you know what? I'm going to stick it out with my black man. She ain't do that. She said, nah, you got to go, nigga. Uh, come 5 o'clock, they finna do the interview. I need you to go somewhere else, so I need my, uh, uh, my benefits. Now, I don't want to sign a marriage paper because I still want to receive my benefits. Come on with it. Because he despised this word. Because we despise this word, read on. And trust and oppression. We trust and oppression. And perverseness. And perverseness. You know what perverseness we trust in? Black Lives Matter. Not as a hashtag, but as an organization. Because Black Lives Matter has been hijacked by the LGBT community. So we trust in that. We trust in the lives of America. We trust in gang Bring it out. We trust in Christianity. We trust in Islam. Y'all understand that, bro? Y'all know y'all the gods of the earth, man. That's who you is, man. You, you are a god. You understand what I'm saying? The black man is a god, but because of slavery and because of white supremacy over 400 years, this is what you see. But you are greater than what you have been made here. And we're going to beat that in your head until you finally get it. And y'all, some of y'all will get it, just like some of us got it. We was on the block, too. Read. And trust in oppression. And trust in oppression. And perverseness. And we trust in perverseness. Like the rap music we listening to. Perverse. Perverse. That's what fill your head up to kill. Fill your head up to sell drugs. It's the music you trust in. We trust in perversion. We don't trust in the word of God. All right. We are faithless people. But we don't understand that when we turn to our God, God said he would deliver us from the oppression of man. God said he would deliver us from our enemies that killed us and enslaved us as long as we trust on him. But we don't believe that. Come on. And stay there on. And not only do we trust in it, but we stay there on. We don't want to have, we don't want to try no other way. Right. We do not want to try no other way, no other solution. You know we gonna try everything under the sun, but keep God's commandments. Right. Give me that in First John 14 and 15. Let's start bringing out some of these laws. Come on. This is the book of John, chapter 14 and verse 15. Bring it out. If you love me, keep my commandments. That's if y'all love God out here, if you love God, just throw your hand up. If you love God, throw your hand up. You see that? And y'all, I, I, I appreciate, I appreciate y'all for telling the truth. Y'all hate God. A lot of y'all got the devil on you. Read. If ye love me, keep my commandments. See that? A lot of y'all right. We don't love God. That's why we don't keep his commandments. You know why we don't love God? We haven't been taught to love God. We haven't been taught to keep his commandments. We haven't been taught that there's judgments for not keeping God's commandments. Right. Read. And I will pray the Father, and he shall give you another comforter. So back to Hosea chapter 4. God said, if you love me, keep my commandments. But we don't love God, so we do this. Read. The book of Hosea, chapter 4 and verse 2. Bring it out. By swearing and lying. See 
that we swear against God, we lie against God. And kill him. And kill him. And kill him. And kill him. Drug dealing is a form of killing. That's witchcraft. In Deuteronomy 18, we didn't suffer witches to live right. in, our, in our kingdom. Right. When you sell drugs to your people, you alter their mindset. You're killing them. You're making a drug, a man, into a shell of a man. A lot of these folks that's on drugs, they are only a shell of what they used to be. Bring it out. That's right. Walking zombies. You're killing your own people trying to come up. there got to be a different way to make money. To scream black power while Heron was pushed. But at the end of the day, nothing's in vain. IUIC has been given a vision. The tents of Judah has risen. Many has attempted the mission. Minor murmuring, omitting, and missing the mark. Just reading that he had the flame of fire in his eyes gave us the spark. We on Paul's mission. We out on the road, purple and gold. From Mexico, Cuba, Haiti, Ghana, Sierra Leone. 144,000 boots banging, concrete crackling. These are our men repented at heart. The scriptures is proof. IUIC, we deliver the truth.